Hey guys, welcome back. but you're wearing makeup like tap it out and like feather feather that itch welcome back guys hey <laughs> if you are new to cha my channel hi my name is Sarah and I make a lot of plus-size fashion videos and other videos mom videos decor videos whatever I make a lot of different types of stuff mostly plus-size fashion though if we're gonna be honest so if that's something you are interested in it would mean the world to me if you stuck around and hit that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell um yeah so that would mean the world if you want to do that uh but today's video is going to be yet another plus-size fashion haul and this video is actually kind of a, a stem off from my fairy season video a couple of videos back i did that video and um you guys seem to really enjoy it and got a lot of responses from that. And so this is kind of like a follow-up video. So basically, very season is similar to like Zaffle and Xi'an, Xi'an, um, Wish, all of that. It's an Asian-based company. And they have a lot of really cute, like trendy fashion for inexpensive prices. Now, fairy, my fairy season haul was kind of like a hit or miss. Like there were some good things I really liked and some things that I didn't love. And I was totally honest with you guys about that. Um, and so Fairy Season reached out to me again, or the company reached out to me and were very sweet and wanted to work with me again. But they told me that they had just started a new line, a new store dedicated just to plus size. So it's called Plus and Love. I will leave it linked below. Once again, this is not a sponsored video. I don't get any money for saying any of this stuff. It's 100% my honest opinion, but I will leave a link below. I was a little apprehensive because I didn't know how it was gonna go because my fairy season one was kind of like, um, and it actually went pretty well. I'm actually really impressed again with it. I think this time was way better than last time, but there are a couple things where kind of like, I don't really know. So I'll let you guys be the judge and let's just get started. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the, actually the shirt that I'm wearing. Um, I already filmed in this shirt, so don't judge me if you see another video already like this. Pre-filming, guys, pre-filming. Anyway, um, this shirt is one of the shirts that I got, and I'm pretty sure I laced it completely wrong. Basically, it came unlaced and with like a string that I had a lace and I did it wrong. I'm terrible at lacing things. I have no idea why I struggle so badly. It's so ridiculous. That and putting keys in the door are some very easy tasks that I struggle with. Anyway, so, um, but basically it's a off the shoulder or one shouldered shirt that has all of these studs and grommets and you lace it up. I will show you the link or the picture of, um, what all of these look like in comparison. Um, this is what it's probably supposed to look like and this is totally what I messed up on doing. <laughs> but I still think it looks really freaking cool. I really like it. It gives me like a really fun edgy vibe. It's perfect for the fall and like transitional because it's like black and like cool, but it's not super hot and like long sleeve yet. I really like it. The fabric is actually really nice. It's not super flimsy or really thin. It's nice and opaque. It has a good stretch to this. Now, just like most Asian companies and everything I've ordered from before, I've purchased everything in a 4XL, which for me corresponds to a size 16, maybe a size 18 um, US. And uh, yeah, so definitely, definitely size up, but I'm pleasantly surprised with this. This is nice and stretchy. I feel like you, I could have sized down to a 3X and would have been fine. Um, so if you are 16, 18, probably upwards of like 20, then this could totally, it will work. It's nice and stretchy. I like it a lot. Yeah, I like this. So see you and try on. I'm gonna wear this a lot. I really like it. <laughs> Okay, so this next shirt was more of a fail. Um, I don't know what happened. Uh, once again, this isn't a 4X, and this was supposed to be kind of like a high neck, like chokery kind of shirt with off the shoulder. You'll see the picture. And it did not look, that didn't work out with the shoulder, the like neck thing. It looks very weird. It's like, 
they took like a regular t-shirt and kind of cut around i don't really know how that happened but it, it was not it doesn't look anything like the picture to be honest with you um but besides that if you actually tuck in that um like neck area and just do off the shoulder i freaking love this shirt because it is really lightweight. It feels like a really comfortable t-shirt, which is nice because a lot of times off the shoulder shirts are like kind of stiff or a little like they're not as flowy. They don't have a lot of give to them. They may not be as comfortable like for the everyday. This one is. It's really comfortable, but the elastic on the actual like arms and everything is really, really nice and like strong so it stays put where it's supposed to um it's nice and stretchy because it is cotton it has like that t-shirt material so although i really don't understand what the whole like neck thing is i actually really like the shirt if i just kind of like tuck that bad boy down and i think it looks really pretty it's in a navy color and i think it looks nice against my pale as hell skin tone <laughs> um yeah so although kind of a fail kind of a win it's kind of a weird okay, so situation i, I don't really know how to like I categorize this but out, so i try to manage really like to it, stretch it out a, a little bit way. and cross it over this my giant head in the and it definitely looks a lot better so i feel like you get kind of a twofer in this shirt you can tuck it in and do off the shoulder which i think looks really cute and it looks cute with crisscross too so sorry for that ridiculous instance All right, so this next thing I'm actually pretty sad about because it is too small. It is too small. I don't know what happened. I didn't get this in a 4X. It was in a 3X. I think it, that might have actually been the highest it went in size. Um, and it's basically a two-piece bathing suit. They have high-waisted bottoms. It's actually really nice. It's very similar to um, the bathing suit I showed you my last, my couple videos back, my swimwear haul, the, like, rose bathing suit bottom it's very similar to that it does have some stretch but honestly not a whole lot there's more stretch in the sides and there's in the waist like the waist doesn't have like very much stretch at all um the sides have a bit more um it's really cute i love the runch ruching and the top is also very cute and pretty there's actually a decent amount of like support in the cups, which is pretty nice because that doesn't always happen, especially with very inexpensive swimsuits. But it's just too small. Um, this this is not gonna fit anybody. Like this barely cups, barely covers my areolas. So um, we're gonna see how this looks in the try on portion. I honestly, I always film this before I try on, so it's gonna be interesting to see how I make this work during the trial portion <laughs> but it's super freaking cute and i actually really like it i think the quality is there much um better than the last time i tried one of their swimsuits i think the quality is definitely they've definitely stepped up their game with it i love like the pleating on the like uh actual boob cup bikini top but it just doesn't fit so i'm actually gonna lend this or not lend this give this to one of my friends um and see how she likes it because just way too small so it's a sad day because it's a freaking cute swimsuit but definitely not for the plus size body but if you're straight sized recommend i'm not really sure about this next stop i order things really late at night and uh i don't i in my head i think like it's like i become a different person at night time and i'm like oh this will look great I love this and then I'm like what were you thinking 3 a.m. Sarah like what were you thinking that's kind of what this was now I won't say this is like a bad quality item or anything like that I mean I think the other items are superior in quality um, compared to this one but I don't know what I was thinking when I ordered this <laughs> um, I actually think I'm gonna give this to my mom because it's a lot more like her basically it's like a halter top with this kind of scarf vibe to it i think when i saw it online it looked a lot more like a like a 90s striped top i'll include the picture and i was like that's kind of cool like i kind of kind of make the work it's kind of like 70s vibe but kind of a 90s twist to it like i like that it's in i think that would look cool for the fall time and then i got it and i'm like i don't really it totally makes me think of something my mom would wear like and my mom 
one's actually pretty fashionable. But just, I don't know, it just like, the colors and like, it's like a, kind of a scarfy top layer on it and then like the bottom is an actual like black tube top but there's like an overlay of the scarf and then you tie up with the halter there's like rings for the halter straps and everything i don't really know guys i don't really know what to tell you i don't really know what i was thinking it's not necessarily a bad item the size is fine there is ruching on the sides of the actual um shirt which i think kind of helps with the shape I just don't know about maybe the like scarfy kind of part of it. Maybe if it was a different like fabric or something, maybe that would work a little bit better, um, at least for me. But I mean, if this is your vibe, like go for it. Just, I don't think, I'd, it's just not mine. It's just not mine. I don't know what I'm trying it on right here. You're gonna see a try on haul, but I'm just in my head. <laughs> I don't know. I. I think I thought it was going to be something different than what I got. It's not necessarily bad, it's just not what I anticipated or my style, so I don't know why I picked it up for myself, but I'm going to try to hand it off to my mom. I think she'd actually like it. All right, so this next piece I freaking love. Um, this is similar to something Sarah Ray Vargas had a while back, and the piece she ordered, I feel like um, the bottoms i think she got it from zaffle maybe she got it from wish but the bottom of it like kind of flared out and was like really cool and kind of had like this it was like it was like lined with something kind of kind of cup she called it her like cupcake shirt or something and i thought it was so cute and then i saw something very similar on uh plus in love and i was like god i have to have it and i love this thing i think it's so pretty my mom loves it too she thinks it's really nice once again another transitional piece for fall it looks really nice on i will say it's definitely sheer like you're gonna have to wear like if you want to wear the bralette could look actually really pretty with the bralette like a mauve bralette or like a, a cami or tank top underneath i definitely would recommend that because it is sheer sometimes when i do these try on hauls a lot of you guys are like why didn't you try you know like why didn't you wear different things like why did you try it like that and i want to show you sometimes how I want it to look as honest as I can like if I'm wearing a black bra underneath it I want to show you the black bra to show you like the sheerness of it You know so you're not like deceived to being like, okay Yeah, no, that'll totally work and you get it and you're like, oh gosh, that's so incredibly sheer So it's kind of why I do that sometimes I get some comments that people like why would you wear it with that? And it's not like I'd actually wear it out like that I'm just trying to show you or like if I tug on it or try to show you it's big or something I'm trying to show you the actual garment and how it lays on the body if that makes any sense Anyway, so definitely a sheer, so you definitely will need to wear something underneath it, but I love it. Um, it is a little bit shorter as well, but it hits really nicely on the body. I feel like it covers my like little mom pouch, um, but kind of like shows the booty off nicely. I like it a lot. I'm really excited to wear it for the fall. I think it's really, really pretty. It does tie around back to kind of cinch in the waist. Once again, this was a good... A good win and that is the end of this video and oh my gosh it's under 15 minutes i feel like this is a new record guys um so please let me know if you enjoyed this and i plan on kind of venturing more into the website i feel like this was a lot more of a win so i like to try websites and stores um obviously more than once unless if it was like the worst experience ever i like to give them a couple shots to check consistency if they're consistent in the quality to kind of give them a you know a second chance if the first chance didn't work out so great and i didn't know how to, i felt um uh, but also just to kind of see the variation in their clothing how they you know how the cuts were, how the fabric will, if they step up their game. I feel like now that they released this new shop, that their their quality is a bit better. Um, so yeah, and they have a lot of really cute like fall themed t-shirts that I'm thinking would be like fun video because I always love seeing like all the Pinterest moms that have like the cute like Hocus Pocus t-shirts and look really cute and folly and I'm like going to click on the link and it's like $35. And I'm not paying that. So I'm kind of excited. I want to try to get some t-shirts that are like fall themed. And um, I think that would be like a really fun video. So the only thing I will say is it does, the shipping does take a long time to get to. It takes a couple of weeks. So if there's something you see and you need it for a certain occasion or a certain time, like order it early because it does take a while to come in. That is like pretty much my only negative about the thing. But then again, it is international and it does come from China. So... 
But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, let me know below if there's anything you want to see, if any stores you want to try for me to try and venture into. Um, I'm excited for fall fashion to start hitting stores. I know it's only July, but Mama's ready for summer to be over and for August to hit and for me to decorate and become a damn pumpkin. I'm excited for it. I hope you guys are excited too. And I will talk to you guys all very soon.